where dreams of corruption are made. <laughs> yeah, someone really likes the ANC. Um, this is like, for me, I, I feel like vomiting. Hello, ladies and gentlemen, welcome to the Joy Media Show. This edition is called Social Media Circus. It's a show where um, some of you have sent in memes, videos, TikTok videos, headlines, and you wanted me to kind of just commentate on it. And we're gonna have some fun together, crack some jokes, and see what exactly South Africans are saying on social media. And if you're new to my channel, please consider giving it a subscribe. It'd be greatly appreciated. So please, Sit down, have some popcorn, and let's have some fun together. I hope this brings a smile to your face. And uh, yeah, let's let's see what happens. I've got a master plan. <laughs> one million. No, it's not one million. That's not enough money. 300. No, wait. 500 billion rand. Right? Yeah. Where's the money? Nobody knows. I'll do it myself. <laughs> That's Ish Magashule. I'll do it myself. It's not his voice. I don't know why. Um, hello, help desk. I'm having problems running my country. Have you tried switching it off and on again? Yes, twice a day. <laughs> Obviously, a load shedding joke because of stage two, three, and four, where South Africa doesn't have electricity two times a day at least sometimes. Uh, well, sometimes it's once a day, but recently it's been twice a day. So yeah, rolling blackouts, ladies and gentlemen. Girlfriends had the COVID jab. It didn't go well. Wow. That's just sad on so many levels. Um, <laughs> I can't remember an ANC proverb. Absolutely. I mean, everything in the Zando Commission, anytime anyone's asked about anything, it's like, I can't remember. I can't remember. You know, idea. I can't remember. I just, I can't. So no, I don't remember. Be glad it wasn't Zuma who put us on lockdown. We would all be stuck at home for 20 hundred and 1,000 days. <laughs> For those of you who don't know uh, that joke, basically, Zuma can't count. Listen properly. Follow me for more load shedding hacks. <laughs> Making toasted bread. I'm sure, how many of you, come on, how many of you have actually done this? Like, come on, there must, you know, it's no electricity, you know. If you have any hacks, comment below, let me know. My fellow, <laughs> end the lockdown. I would say we listen to Batman. I think that's a good idea. Promise everything, deliver nothing. Blame someone else, ANC, coming to a government near you. Not a good movie. Not a good movie. <laughs> this is a headline. It's pretty messed up. Um, I, I don't know if this is real. Comps beat Chinese man after asking for his name. I've lost all faith in our police, says... I can't even say it. <laughs> um, but you guys can see there. Uh, <laughs> So it probably was a situation, like if this is real, I imagine like the cops were like, sir, what's your name? And he was like, and then they were like, what, what did you say? And then, yeah, um, unfortunately, unfortunate name, unfortunate name. Getting rid of these because we have these is like getting rid of these because we have these. Yeah, pretty much. They want to mend the current gun bill at the moment in South Africa and uh, it's a big fight happening at the moment. Please go check out Dear SA. I will link it in the description below. Have your say and check out my recent uh, video with uh, Gideon and Aziza to get more information on this. Grand Theft Auto South Africa. Speaking of which, rebelstoreza.com has this design. Um, not, not the background, but just the Grand Theft Auto South Africa on a shirt. If you guys want to go purchase it, it is available on rebelstoreza.com. Uh, but this is interesting. This is done by the DA saying more theft or change your choice. Um, that's brilliant. Nice little jab from the DA at the ANC. Yeah, Grand Theft Auto South Africa. That's the current situation we're living in, guys. It really is. We have no law. People are doing whatever they want to do. Uh, load shedding. No, what? It's, it's a mess. It's, it's a mess. I think actually living in Grand GTA 5 would be better than living in South Africa, to be honest. The time, stand by! Take two! Stand by!
Also, ladies and gentlemen, while I have you here, please go check out uh, the link in the description. Support me monthly with perks. That's right, you can support the show monthly now um, through Quicket, and each tier come with their own benefits. So please go check it out. Uh, and your support is greatly appreciated. It's not a must. And remember, subscribing is always free. 1.5 million rand for an NHI creative proposal, quotation marks, 1.1 million rand for Pilo the Cash Cow mascot, 500K for the NHI's look and feel, we reveal digital vibes, Donji, 23 million Rand health NHI billings. This is crazy. And I like what this guy said, how he put the cash in parentheses because, you know, it's it's so ironic that they made a cow. They decided, you know what? You know what we need right now in this current lockdown situation with this pandemic going on? Do you know what we need right now? This is what we need. A cow. That will get people to follow our lead. I mean, everyone listens to a cow, right? Global heating study shows impact of climate racism in the US. What? So now the climate is racist. I mean, I don't know how to react to that. What is going on? The climate, it's like saying that the economy is racist. It, it, uh, in, uh, con, I just, I can't. What does it look like I do for a living? Solve mysteries with talk. <laughs> oh my word, he does. He looks like Shaggy. <laughs> what, uh, Scooby-Doo. I don't know if I can do a Scooby-Doo. Um, Shaggy? Then, then Shaggy? Right. Scooby Snacks. No, that's not him. That's more like a Yoda. I'll work on it. Gone, baby, gone. <laughs> yeah, I don't know what's happening with the story, guys. I don't know. Some lady had 10 babies, but then she didn't have 10 babies. Um, it turns out it was a fake story. They can't find the kid. I don't know what the hell is going on. Can someone please put a link in the comments and let me know what is going on with the story? Honestly, it kind of looks like they um, face apped Zuma's face on that woman. So, I mean, I'm not sure what's going on here. For my iPad. Somebody stole my iPad. <laughs> huh? Somebody decided that they want to dispossess me of my iPad. So I want that. Can I have my iPad, please? So they stole it. Ah, uh, man, yeah, the president's iPad is stolen. We gotta get the Secret Service on this. We gotta get everybody. All your taxes are gonna go towards finding his iPad. Maybe, or maybe he'll just buy a new iPad. Um, but, uh, yeah. <laughs> Welcome to South Africa, Mr. President. What a heist. I don't know. Is that even a heist? I don't know. Like, it's, it's like, wow. <laughs> you know, like, if you were the thief, right? Like, would you want to brag about it? Like, this is the president's, you know, someone, it would, you know, this is the president's iPad. I got the president's iPad. Woo! Like, is that a big accomplishment, a big trophy? And then, like, I think maybe we should go on eBay or something or Gumtree and just search iPad and see. They're listed, President's iPad for sale. Um, <laughs> owned by the President exclusively. President didn't want it, left it on a chair. I grabbed it and now I'm selling it. Um, <laughs> I don't know, maybe that's what the, uh, the, uh, the ad would say. 500 million rand spent on finding President's iPad. Where dreams of corruption are made. <laughs> yeah. Someone really likes the ANC. Um, this is like, for me, I, I feel like vomiting. And there you have it, folks. This has been a Social Media Circus. I hope you enjoyed it. Please comment in the comment section. Let me know what you thought. And stay tuned, because there's a bonus clip at the end. That's right. There's an end credit scene like Marvel movies. Please don't forget to check out rebelstoreza.com. They got some great merch on that shop. And also don't forget to check out my Telegram channel. It's a channel, not a group. So you'll get notified of all the upcoming uploads and live streams. This is your second reminder to please subscribe to my channel. Give this video a like if you enjoyed it. And also don't forget to share this video. It goes a long way if you do. And with that being said, ladies and gentlemen, stay safe, be kind to one another, and I'll see you at the next one. Cheers.
Can then, uh, you, Honorable we Matisha, can only come and say, Honorable Matisha, Hong, 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 like that. Honorable member. Matisha, yes, Hong, 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 Honorable Matisha, Hong, Hong, Hong. Honorable Matisha, that's the only thing Point that she knows. Honorable Matisha. Yes.